Today on MTG Unpacked, it's time for a triple dose of chaos. That's right, we're cracking open three chaos mystery boxes here for patrons. So let's introduce the patrons. We have Oscar Cinto Estrada and Gav. All right, so let's arrange things here. We will first pick one for Gav. So rolling one through three, four through six, and then we'll narrow it down from there. So we have a four, so that will be the second row. All right, and then one through five, let's see how we do. We get a two, okay, so this one will go to Gav. Pop that over there, and now we have two more to pick for Oscar. So rolling one, okay, first row, and a two, so he gets this one. And we repeat the process here, rolling, get a six, so second row, one through four, five, not what we need. Okay, so these two will go to Oscar, so get the rest of this stuff out of the way and get cracking. And these are my vision for how a Chaos Mystery Box should be. If you have not seen these before, I'll pop a link up in the corner there to the complete playlist. All right, so Oscar, let's dig in. The theme this month is the gods of Theros. So as you might imagine, there could be some god pools here. So let's take a look. So get that one out of the way. Thank you for being a patron, Oscar. Okay, Modern Horizons, Ixalan, Ravnica Allegiance. Oh, Karanos, God of Storms. We'll take a look at that in a moment. War of the Spark, Theros, and Born of the Gods. Okay, so we'll do this. Oh, actually, we'll get that out of the way first. Get our bland vegetables out of the way. And let's see what we've got for Oscar in his first Chaos Box. Okay, so let's boost the lighting a tad. It's a little dim here. Okay, Karanos, God of Storms, Foil, Ledrian Enchantment Creature God. 6-5 five for 5 has indestructible. As long as your devotion to blue and red is less than 7. Karanos isn't a creature. Reveal the first card you draw on each of your turns. Whenever you reveal a land card this way, draw a card. Whenever you reveal a non-land card this way, you do 3 damage to target creature or player. Very tasty pull indeed. A mythic. Okay. So let's set that aside and get cracking here. And the patrons get the rares, mythics, foils, and anything over a buck. Okay, so we'll take a look at Ixalan if I can get the pack open. Okay, starting off, Rummaging Goblin, Goblin Rogue, one with the wind, Crash the Ramparts, Wind Strider, Fire Cannon Blast, Spreading Rot, Costly Plunder, Headwater Sentries, Hierophant's Chalice, and Uncommon Stormfleet Aerialist, Stormfleet Spy. Drover of the Mighty and the Rare. Oh no, it's a Foil Demolish. Okay, so then the Rare must be, oh, a double-sided card. So we've got Argwell's Bloodfast, the Dream Enchantment for two. Pay one in a black, pay two life, draw a card at the beginning of your upkeep. You may have, or if you have five or less life, you may transform Argwell's Bloodfast into the Temple of Aklazots. So you can tap it for a single black mana. Or tap Psycho Creature, you gain life equal to the Sacrifice Creature's Toughness. Okay, and a Checklist and Vampire Token. Alright, we'll set these over here. Next up, Born of the Gods. So a chance for a Tasty God Pool here as well. And we've got a Fearsome Temper, Servant of Timeret. Cool looking zombie, Satyr Wayfinder, Faragax Giant. Retraction Helix Nullify, Cyclops of One-Eyed Pass, Necrobite, Sudden Storm, Uncommons, Udunus River Trawler, that's a creepy looking zombie, Fanatic of Xenagos, Noble Quarry, and the rare is Herald of Torment, Enchantment Creature Demon 333, has Bestow 3 and 2 Black, if you cast this card for its Bestow cost, it's an Aura spell, Enchant Creature, it becomes a creature again if it's not attached to a creature, is flying at the beginning of your upkeep, you lose one life, Enchanted Creature gets plus three, plus three, and has flying. Okay, and a foil, Nyxborn Triton. A mountain, and a bit about 
Creatures Index. Okay, moving on here to War of the Spark. So hoping for a rare or mythic Planeswalker. Okay, next up we have Sky Theater Strix, a goblin assailant creature, goblin warrior. Mateshift Battalion, Kazmina's Transmutation, Primordial Worm. Kaya's Ghost Form, Callus Dismissal, Nahiri's Stoneblades, Band Together, and Uncommon's Vizier of the Scorpion, Chandra's Triumph, Emergent Zone, and the rare, yes, it's Khan, the Great Creator. The Dream Planeswalker, Khan, 5 loyalty for 4. Availability is artifacts your opponent's control can't be activated, his plus one until your next turn to one target non creature artifact becomes an artifact creature with the power and toughness equal to its converted banner cost. And minus two, you may choose an artifact card you own from outside the game or in it, so reveal it and put it into your hand. Very tasty pull there, and a foil rare. Whoa, Khan's Bastion. Land, tap it for colorless mana, pay four, tap, you get to proliferate. Okay, and a forest and citizen token. So this is pretty cool so far. Let's arrange things like so. Ravnica Allegiance, looking for the Shocklands as always. We've got Spikequill Acrobat, Twilight Panther, Sage's Row Savant, Rebel Wilt Recluse, Thirsting Shade, Stony Strength. Summary Judgment, Ceruli Caretaker, Law Mages Binding, Goblin Gathering, very nice, Borak Clan Crusher, Light Up the Stage, if I'm not mistaken, that is still a buck or two, I'll chuck that in, Tower Defense, and the rare is Gutter Bones, Creature Skeleton Warrior 2 1 for a single black, Enter the Battlefield Tap, 4 1 and black, return him from your graveyard to your hand, activate this ability only during your turn, and only if the opponent lost life this turn. Get a Simic Gilgate and a Zombie token. Okay, so onward to Theros. And I'm a broken record by this point. Who is looking forward to Theros Beyond Death? Actually, I should say who is not looking forward to it? Who sees nothing of any redeeming value in that set? Leave a note in the comments. Next, we have Lightning Strike, Ferris Band, Centaurs, Divine Verdict. Savage Surge, Opaline Unicorn, Crackling Triton, Portent of Betrayal, Commune with the Gods, Returned Phalanx, Zombie Soldiers, that's pretty cool, Laguna Band Elder, Uncommons, Kragma War Cooler, Triton Fortune Hunter, Warrior's Lesson, and Rare is Anger of the Gods, Sorcery for 3, it deals 3 damage to each creature, if a creature dealt damage so I would die this turn, exile it instead. And a Mountain, and Soldier Token. Final pack here for the first Chaos Box for Oscar. Getting stuck into Modern Horizons. And this is in the traditional order. All right, Trustworthy Scout. Quakefoot Cyclops, Chiller Pillar, love that name. Rhyme Tender, Wart Eye Witch, Creature Goblin Shaman. Mother Bear, First Fear Gargantua, Gilded Light. Elvish Fury and Uncommon's Firebolt. Rebuild. Talisman of Curiosity and a 3 4 blue. It is Bizarre Trade Mage. Creature Human Wizard 3 4 for 3 with flying. When it ends Badfield, draw 2 cards and discard 3. Okay, a Foil Igneous Elemental. And a Snow Covered Plains. Arkham's Astrolabe. Not sure which way around that goes. And an elemental token, non-foil, okay. So let's put this stuff in the envelope there for Oscar. And now we're going to leave him in suspense. Because we're going to switch over to Gav. So this one was Oscar's, put that there. Alright, Gav, thank you for being a patron. Let's see what we can get in your chaos box today. And normally I would have had uh, one of these videos earlier in the month. But one of the cards was delayed, one of the foils, so I had to wait for that. So we have Modern Horizons, Ixlan, Guilds, Krufix, God of Horizons. Very nice. War of the Spark, Theros, Unborn of the Gods. Okay, so let's do something like this. Okay, so Gav, what do we have here? Check it out. We got 
Trufix, God of Horizons, that's an enchantment creature, God 4, 7 for 5, with indestructible, as long as your devotion to green and blue is less than 7, Crufix isn't a creature, you have no maximum hand size, and if unused mana would empty from your mana pool, that mana becomes colourless instead, so some tasty foiling there, let's give that a little more, yeah, there we go, some nice foiling action. Foils don't always show up the best with my lighting here, but hopefully that came out better. Okay, Gav, born of the gods. Let's see if we can beat what Oscar had there. Starting off with Weight of the Underworld, Satessan Oathsworn, Exorciate. Rise to the challenge. Yes, he will indeed. Nyxborn Triton, Cyclops of One-Eyed Pass, Necrobite. Sudden Storm, Kragma Butcher. Aspect of Hydra, Aeshiox Adept, first the Uncommon Thunderbrute, Bioblight, and rare is Fate Unraveler, Enchantment Creature Hag. Three, four, for four, I'm very tempted to do a Cackling Witch voice, but I think I'll end up choking whenever an opponent draws a card. Fate Unraveler deals one damage to that player. Okay, a Forest and Centaur token, that's pretty cool actually, I'll chuck that in as well. Ixalan up next. Okay, Ixalan, what goodies do you have for us today? Slash of Talons, Depths of Desire, Rival Herald's Boon, Anointed Deacon, Stormfleet Pyromancer, Siren's Ruse, Jungle Delver, Raptor Companion, Ancient Brontodon, Uncommon's Dinosaur Stampede, Ixalan's Binding, Sky Terror, and the rare is Ashes of the Abhorrent, enchantment for two. Players can't cast spells from graveyards or activate abilities of cards in graveyards. Whenever a creature dies, you gain one life. Okay, and a foil, Cobbled Wings. Okay then. A mountain and treasure token. So what is your favorite set out of the ones here? And if it is your favorite because you had a crazy pull, or you just like the mechanics, leave a note in the comments. Next up, War of the Spark, Martyr for the Cause, Naga Eternal, Goblin Assailant Creature, Goblin Warrior, Crunch Wrangler, Kaya's Ghost Form, Snare Spinner, Bane Hound, Band Together, Gateway Plaza, and Uncommon's Leyline, Prowler, Angress, Rampage, Godfrey Statue, and if you look really close, you can see Fibble Thip up the top there. And very nice, rare, Soren, Vengeful, Bloodlord, four loyalty for four. Legendary Planeswalker Soren, as long as it's your turn, creatures and Planeswalkers you control have lifelink. Is plus two, deals one damage to target player or Planeswalker. Minus sets, return target creature card with convert mana cost sets from your graveyard to the battlefield. That creature is a vampire, in addition to its other types. Okay, a foil mountain, another mountain, and wall token. Okay, onward to Theros. Still hoping for another god pool. This is actually from a new box. So we'll see how we do. Nylea's Disciple, Lash of the Whip, Ray of Disillusion, Wave Crash, Triton, Portent of Betrayal, Commune with the Gods, Return Phalanx, Lagonaban Elder, Lost in a Labyrinth. Uh, don't they have another Labyrinth card in uh, Theros Beyond Death? Forget what it's called. Heliod's Emissary, Uncommon's Dauntless Onslaught, Witch's Eye, and the rare is Psychic Intrusion, Sorcery for five. Target opponent reveals his or her hand, you choose a non-land card from that player's graveyard or hand and exile it. You cast that card for as long as it remains exiled and you may spend mana as or well, mana of any colour to cast that spell. Ooh, this is tasty, Asphodel Wanderer, Skeleton Soldier, alright. Mountain and Magic 2014. Do you believe Magic 2014 was the best era in Magic's history? Leave a note in the comments. Okay, next we have Wall of Mist, Wojek Bodyguard. Okay, Take Heart, Demir Informant, Looking for Shocklands, Never Happened, Hitchclaw, Recluse, Deadly Visit, Iron Shell Beetle, Rosemane Centaur, Garrison Sergeant, Uncommon's Night Vale Sprite, Might of the Masses, Creeping Chill, and the rare is a split card. Expansion and Explosion, so Expansion is an instant for two. 
Copy target install sorcery spell with command manacles for all less you may choose. New targets for the copy. Explosion instant 4x, 2 blue, 2 red. It deals x damage to any target. Target player draws x cards. Okay, and a Slesna Gilgate and Soldier Token. Wrapping things up for Gav, we have Modern Horizons. Alright, hopefully it'll do better than that last pack in this video. We have Ephemerate, Bogarden Dragonheart, Enduring Sliver, Viashino Sand Sprinter, Headless Spectre, Spore Frog, Magmatic Sinkhole, Amorphous Axe, Reign of Revelation, Shenanigans, Uncommons, Valiant Changeling, Webweaver Changeling, Goblin or a Flam, and the rare is Crashing Footfalls. It's a sorcery. For how much? Suspend four on a green. So rather than cast this card from your hand, pay green, exile it with four time counters on it. At the beginning of your upkeep, remove a time counter. When the last is removed, cast it without paying its mana cost. Okay, so you're delaying the spell. Create two fourfold green rhino creature tokens with trample. Okay. And a snow-covered plains, Arkham's Astrolabe, that's pretty funny. And a foil zombie token. Okay, so let's set these aside for Gav. Scoop it all up. No crazy mythics yet other than the foils that are coming with these. Okay, so there we go, Gav. Thank you once again for being a patron. Back to Oscar for his second go-round. If I can get the box open. We did the uh, patron snap packs yesterday, so that was a pretty crazy time. My arms are still dead from that, I think. Modern Horizons, Aether of Alt, Guilds of Ravnica, Eros, God of Victory, Dominaria, Theros, and Journey into Nyx. Okay, so we'll do the... let's do like so. Okay, Oscar, second time is the charm. Fingers crossed for you, sir. So, the god pull here is Uruus, god of victory. Legendary enchantment creature god, 7-4 four for 4 with indestructible. As long as your devotion red and white is less than 7, Uruus isn't a creature. So that concept is coming back for Theros Beyond Death. Creatures you control can't be blocked except by two or more creatures. Prevent all damage that will be dealt to attacking creatures you control. Very nice. Okay, so pop that back in there. Move this aside and it gets stuck into Guilds of Ravnica. So where are the Shocklands? We're getting near the end of another box of this. And still, I don't think we've had that many. Okay, next up we have Barging Sergeant, 10th District Guard, Leapfrog, Phyllis Harbadier, Wild Ceratoc, Parhelion Patrol, Boris Lockett, Siege Worm! Goblin Electromancer! Yes! Split card here, Integrity and Intervention. First Uncommon. Street Riot! Lotleth Giant. And rare is Venerated Loxodon. Creature Elephant Cleric 4 4 for 5 with Convoke. So your creatures can help cast this spell. Each creature you tap while casting it pays for one or a mana of that creature's colour. And when it enters the battlefield, put a plus one plus one counter on each creature that convoked it. Good deal. A foil necrotic wound and Demir Guildgate Elf Knight token. Alrighty, on to Dominaria. So I'm trying to remember what are the good pulls here. Uh, is Urza, I think Urza was in here. Struggling to remember at this point. So many sets. Dub, Gitu Chronicler, Syncopate. Banalish Honor Guard, Stronghold Confessor, was it Teferi was in this one? Lanawar Scout, Runamuck, Jousting Lance, Sapling Migration, Pardic Wanderer, Uncommon's Fire Fist Adept, Settle the Score, oh, seriously? Whoa, Mythic, Khan, you're back, sir, that's pretty funny. Khan, Scion of Urza, Legendary Planeswalker Khan, Five loyalty for four. His plus one reveal the top two cards of your library. And opponent chooses one of them. Put that card into your hand and exile the other with a sliver. Oh, it's not a sliver. A silver counter on it. Okay. Minus one. Put a card you own with a silver counter on it from exile into your hand. Minus two. Create a zero, zero colorless construct artifact creature. Uh, excuse me. Creature token. This creature gets plus one plus one for each artifact you control. My throat is getting very dry. Rona, disciple of Gix. A mountain. 
and soldier token. Okay, so that is very impressive there, sir. But I'm sure we can do better, as always, looking for the mythics. Okay, Theros, we have Flit, Feather Sandals, Ill-Tempered Cyclops, Savage Surge, Zetessen Griffin, Spark Jolt, Coastline Chimera, Return Phalanx, Farika's Cure, Defend the Hearth, Leonin's Snarecaster, and Uncommon's Vanquish the Foul, Karametra's Acolyte, Triton Tactics, and where is Labyrinth Champion, Creature Human Warrior 224, with Heroic, whenever you cast a spell that targets Labyrinth Champion, it deals 2 damage to target creature or player. A planes and a soldier token. Journey into Nyx. Can we get a God Pack sometime? I would really love that. You don't see those very much these days. Every card in the pack is a God craziness. So they had 15 in this block, but alas, this is not one of those packs. We have Halva Scarred, Alcid's Return Reveler, Crufix's Insight, Tajani's Presence, Nature's Panoply, Rise of Eagles, Ferrisband, Thunderhoof, Blade Tusk War, Red Binger, Lampads, Supply Line Cranes, Uncommons, Crystalline Nautilus. Check it out! That is a cool looking creature. Spire Spine, Banishing Light, and a Mythic! What? Holy! Check this out. So. Gav, Crufix, Oscar, 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 you have three gods here. This is craziness. Crufix, God of Horizons, Mythic. So there we are. We've already reviewed this guy earlier in the video. That is very nice indeed. So a couple of Mythics, Planes, and there's Ajani again. Good to see you, Ajani. Ether Revolt. This is the last pack from the previous box. Hoping for a crazy pull here. One of those spicy foil cards. Frontline Rebel. What are the uh, inventions they call them? Dispersal Technician, Audacious Infiltrator, Ali Strangler, Left New Sailback, Implement of Improvement, Welder Automaton, Ether Stream, Leopard, Iron Tread Crusher. Uncommon Xeronaut, Admiral, Ornithopter, Pacification Ray, and rare is Greenwheel Liberator. Creature Elphoria 2 1 for 2 with a revolt. It get, uh, enters the battlefield with 2 plus 1 plus 1 cans on it. If permanent you controlled, left the battlefield this turn. And oh, that is pretty tasty. A foil Felidar Guardian. Alright, an island and thought the token. Alright, so that wasn't quite the shiny goodness we were looking for, but never mind, we'll take it. I think it's still a tasty pull. Modern Horizons wrapping things up here for Oscar. We have String of Disappearances. Holy moly. Answered Prayers, Reckless Charge, Spore Frog, Gluttonous Slug. Yes, we love this fellow, don't we? Winter's Rest, Weather the Storm, Magmatic Sinkhole, Putrid Goblin, Creature Zombie Goblin, Throat Seeker, First Uncommon, Ice Tide Golem, Vespalark, and another Mythic, and not any Mythic, but the first Sliver, Legendary Creature Sliver, 7 7 for 5, Wall with Cascade. When you cast a spell, it's all cards from the top of your library until you exile, a non land card that costs less. You may cast it without paying its mana costs. Put the XL cards on the bottom of your library in a random order. Sliver spells you cast have Cascade. This is a crazy pull indeed. And a foil overcooked chook there. With a snow-covered mountain. And this, what is this? Answered prayers and a non-foil zombie. So Oscar has done very nicely indeed. I think this is pretty much worth uh, more than most of this stuff here. So we'll set these aside, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button for more Magic Gathering unboxings. And I'm having trouble fitting these in here. Be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.